That's a real, real thing, huh? Appreciate the morning, folks. Here we go. Good to see you guys. It is like that. There really isn't a balance. Two to two, one to two cold. <laughs> oh, really? Oh, good. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, we worked out very well. Good to like that. Hello. Good to see you. Good to see you, sir. Good to see you, sir. Good to see you, sir. So uh, I have exactly enough bags. There's not like a spare inch. Get that. Oh, what? Отлично. Вот здесь и ставь. Теперь вот микрофон. Два экипажа. Сместитесь, пожалуйста. Так, все, стоп, 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 стоп. Отлично. Так, пожалуйста, внимание. Еще раз. Все, спасибо. We actually do have a lot of time to rest while we're in Baikonur. A little bit of training, time to rest, and uh, get ourselves organized in the right mindset for our flight. So we're all looking forward to it. Tomorrow is a very responsible day. Tomorrow we're going to spend at the launch pad at the vehicle and perform the pre-final fit checks. It's very important. We're going to be using the spacesuits, lifting the seats, and checking uh, communications. We're going to spend the whole day, and then we're going to have a break, and then about a week until the final fit checks, we're going to go through daily refresher training to maintain the skills we have developed so far. And the last three days we're going to be preparing for the launch. I would like to ask a question to everyone. I understand there are different traditions. If, um, each one of you can explain one tradition that you know of. Could each one of you tell me one of the traditions that there are going to be um, there is one tradition. We watch a movie the night before launch, uh, the white sun of the desert. We're going to do that. Why do you watch it? Well, that's a tradition. We have been watching it um, every time for a while. It helps us set in the right mood uh, that we need. It's one of the traditions. Why this movie? Well, how should I put it? It's the choice of the cosmonauts. Uh, then we also believe it's uh, well made. It, it's in the genre that uh, gives us the emotional mood, the energy about what we need for work like this. Yes, as you mentioned, there are several traditions. Uh, something else we'll do on our fa final morning. Uh, once we've prepared uh, for space flight, we'll be in our flight costumes and um, we'll uh, sign the doors that we were each allocated a door in uh, the Cosmodrome, uh, Cosmonaut Hotel. So we'll each sign the door to the Cosmonaut Hotel that we stay in. Uh, once we finish signing the door, we walk down the hall and we're blessed by the priest. And uh, then we hop on the bus and go to the launch. Uh, Yuri Ivanovich, it's your flight number six. Yes, that is correct. You probably spend more time in space uh, than uh, on the uh, ground. Uh, what is your uh, family's attitude? Are they jealous? No, they're not jealous. Oh, total time I spent in space is over two years. Uh, it's a long uh, time in one's life. I started working in the program back in 1987, uh, so I spent more time on the ground. It's not easy for the family, but they're used to it. They know what everyone needs to do 
Everything is fine. When you're celebrating holidays in orbit, how are you planning to do that? A new year? Well, the, the, based on the traditions of each country, we're going to try to follow the traditions. Are you able to take a sip of cognac on in orbit? We, we could, but we don't have it. So we're going to put together a short family, a short holiday dinner. So that's a holiday. Do you have a lucky charm? Are you taking a zero G indicator with you? Yes. We have not made the final decision yet. No, we have not determined which one yet. Yuri Ivanovich, a question. What tasks, uh, what goals are you setting for this flight? Uh, what your program is going to be? We're going to receive a lot of transportation, cargo, and manned vehicles. We will need to monitor all the dynamic operations. Uh, there will be EVAs and a vast uh, science uh, research program, including the Russian segment program. Uh, we have about 60 experiments, and we're going to be fairly busy. There will be a um, uh, crew handover. The crew members um, who are working on board right now are going to return, and we're going to have new crew members working with us. Uh, what do you think is the most interesting experiment? I like the experiments um, that are related to watching, observing the Earth, because along with uh, performing the experiment, even if it involves specific tools, you work with the tools, but you have another opportunity to look down and watch the Earth from space. I'm, um, I was always interested in that. So it's going to be a very interesting uh, assignment that is related to science and technology. So I will enjoy doing that.